Hey YouTube, my name is Zach, and today I will explain to you the get pivot data function. After this video, you will know all the parts of the get pivot data function and see an example of how it can be used in Microsoft Excel. So, what is get pivot data? This formula is used to return data stored in a pivot table. Get pivot data retrieves data from the pivot table in order to help interpret the large amounts of information in a report. Get pivot data is comprised of four primary parts data field, pivot table, field one, and item one, with a maximum of up to 14 field and item pairs. Data field is the name of the data field you want to retrieve. Pivot table is a reference to any cell in the pivot table and determines which pivot table has the data you want to retrieve. Field 1 and item 1 describe the data you want to retrieve from the pivot table. Here we have a pivot table with some of the Minnesota Twins players batting averages. For this example, we will find the batting average of Joe Maurer. For data field, we will click on the column header sum of BA. For pivot table, we will click on cell A3. For field 1, we will click on the column header above the names. For item 1, we will click on the name we are looking for, in this case, cell A30. In the end, it will look like this equals get pivot data parenthesis quotation mark sum of ba quotation mark comma a3 comma quotation mark name quotation mark comma a30 parenthesis you now know how to use the get pivot data function